Oh, this is your boy Shiver Speak, man. Let's get right into it. Riverdale season four, episode sixteen, chapter seventy three, the locked room. A lot of shit finally goes down to the damn ground in this episode because everything is like a basically a big ass interrogation. Uh, this season wraps up really well what happened and what led up to the the climactic uh, death, quote unquote, of Jughead. And uh, it was really nice. You know, we finally got a backstory as to why Mr. Dupont pretty much had out for Jughead from the very beginning. He wants, basically, I'll put it to you like this. Once Jughead wasn't going to be kissing anyone's ass, Mr. Dupont in particular, that's when Dupont was like, all right, look, we're going to have to do this. You know, that's something we've always done. It's a tradition. We got to get rid of this kid. Because it really, Jughead really was more so, uh, he was damn near done with taking everything, everyone down. You know, Stonewall prep as it was. You know what I'm saying? But with little to no fucking help. And it was impressive, in my opinion, because, you know, a lot, not many people have actually ever stood up to Stonewall Prep and Mr. DuPont, you know, but Jughead did. He, he stood on his morals and he succeeded. I mean, we also had, you know, Donna finally, you know, kind of having to come to the realization that she's just like Mr. DuPont. She's the very thing that she never wanted to be. They said that she she basically became the very thing that she said that she would never be. Brett finally got his ass kicked. Thank God. You know, but then also... The twists and turns to see how this all goes. I have so many damn questions. Like, how the hell does Charles have all this FBI equipment and services on standby like that? And I know, I know a lot of people are saying like, uh, there's got to be something to it, though, right? I mean, come on, bro. But really, that's really that all that really happened in this uh, episode, man. I mean, it was a lot of crazy stuff. Not to mention, I, I know Cheryl and Tony might be going through her stuff as well. And I look forward. To the next episode and how they kind of flesh that out as well. This has been your boy Cherry Speaks. As the thumbnail says, like, comment, and subscribe for more content. Uh, I'm going to be doing this forever, man. I thank you guys for all the support that you guys always do. Um, you guys hit the share button too, to share with your friends. And if you guys have any ideas of what you can do, you guys will tell peace and love.